With the new year starting to settle in, employers are hoping they'll see an increase in their candidate pools. News 10's Aliyah Blackburn speaks with two local companies. She has more on their struggle to find workers in tonight's Economy Watch 10. For quite some time, Bemis Company in Terre Haute had no shortage in finding employees. We would put the sign out and have to take it down in a week because we'd have 400 applications. Just a few days into 2016, the sign still sits on the Bemis Company lawn. Don Sutton, regional HR manager, says they've been looking to hire since 2014. We've just struggled with uh, finding folks with good, good work history. Sutton says she hopes to hire 80 to 120 people this year, even working with school corporations to help find candidates. We've reached out to the high schools to try to provide another alternative for people that are going to college or to trade school. We'll put a part in, flip it over, put it in the second operation. And not too far away in Brazil, Morris Manufacturing and Sales is dealing with a similar problem. It's still kind of difficult to fill the positions. HR manager Rick Whitlock says they recently started a training placement program. It's made a big difference in terms of our being able to just create opportunities for individuals within the community. While the year is still fresh, management on both ends are hoping for the best. We'll continue to look for people and, and um, try and try and fill our positions. In Vigo and Clay County with photojournalist Tony Cassasia, Aaliyah Blackburn, News 10. If you're interested in applying to the companies seen in this story, visit our website, WTHITV.com, for contact information.